U.S. First Lady Melania Trump spent her day in Nairobi on visits to various city destinations, including a children's home in Gigiri, the Nairobi National Park, and the Kenyan National Theatre. Mrs. Trump was accompanied by First Lady Margaret Kenyatta. Brian O'Koth tells us more about the U.S. First Lady's engagements earlier today. Sporting a casual look, the first destination Friday morning for the 48-year-old American First Lady was the Nairobi National Park where she fed baby elephants at the David Sheldrick Center. Mrs. Trump chuckled after one of the baby elephants moved suddenly, causing her to almost lose her footing. The visiting dignitary later visited the Nest Children's Home in Gigiri, Nairobi, where she sang and danced with the young ones. Security was beefed up at the premises as Mrs. Trump interacted with the children, who engaged her in joyful greetings and dances. Kenyan First Lady Margaret Kenyatta then hosted Melania Trump at State House, Nairobi, where they held closed-door talks. State House says the talks focused on matters of health, especially the welfare of mothers and children and conservation. The Kenyan First Lady is the patron of the Beyond Zero Health Initiative for Mothers and Children. Mrs. Kenyatta showed her guests artistic impressions of the proposed two billion shilling beyond zero model referral hospital that the Kenyan First Lady plans to implement as part of her legacy. Later, the two First Ladies proceeded to the Kenya National Theater where they were treated to 45 minutes of live cultural performances staged by Sarah Cassidy Group, an aerobic-based dancing and acrobatic group. State House says Melania's visit to Kenya follows a discussion she held with Margaret Kenyatta at White House when Kenya's first family visited the Trumps at Washington, D.C. in August. Ahead of a Kenyan visit, Melania toured Ghana and Malawi as part of a four-day maiden African tour. The visiting first lady will leave the country for Egypt tomorrow by 9 p.m. Brian Okoth for Citizen TV.